Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So in today's video, I'm going to be doing an updated Bath and Body Works collection video. And I'm just gonna show you guys everything that I have from candles to body care. I figured I'd redo this video a few months later because I have used up quite a bit of stuff, but I also got a lot of new stuff at the SAS sale this summer. So I just wanna keep track of everything that I have. So I figured this might be like a video I'll do every two or three months and just keep up with my collection. So if you guys are ready to see what I have in my collection, then just keep watching. So I have everything laid out on the bed right here. And I'm just going to start off down here with lotions and all the body care. So right now I have three body creams. I have Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin, which is like halfway used. Pearberry, which is like not used at all. And uh, Georgia Peach and Sweet Tea, which is almost finished, but not quite. And then I have two shower gels. I have Strawberry Pound Cake, which I got at SAS. And Mary Cherry Cheer, which is almost done. And then I only have one more body lotion left and it's Mary Cherry Cheer. And then I have this one in um, Aromatherapy Sleep in Black Chamomile. And then I only have one scrub left in Lavender and Sandalwood. And then I have one kind of like random hand cream. It's a Cetaphil Intensive Moisturizing Cream. And then up here, I only have three body sprays left. I have Frosted Wonderland. I have Almond Blossom and Love, Love, Love. And then I've got a few travel size things. I have Pretty as a Peach Shower Gel and this weekend Body Lotion. I've got Bali Black Coconut Sands Shower Gel and the Tiggy Bay Island Margarita Body Cream. And then I have this little soft soap pomegranate one. It's a um, shower gel. And then I have this one uh, Mineral Co Hydrating Body Oil in Moonstone. I have two hand creams, Fiji Sunshine Guavatini and Strawberry Pound Cake. Both are unopened. And then I've got a few random perfumes. This is Ariana Grande's kind of like, it was a Christmas set, I think. And then these two little random guys. And then up here I have my hand sanitizers, which has gone down pretty significantly, as you can probably guess, because I'm using a lot more. I have Merry and Bright, Fresh Sparkling Snow, I'm really a mermaid, which I think is, it says Surf and Sands. Um, eucalyptus Mint, no, Eucalyptus and Spearmint Stress Relief. You're the best, which is just like a floral fragrance note. Um, and then Gingham and Vanilla Coconut. I only have two more Wallflower Fragrance Refills, Rosewater and Ivy and Peppermint Brownie. And then I have these two little bitty um, candles. These are the tester candles. I got these at SAS Pumpkin Clove and Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. Oh, also, I got these two travel size items at SAS as well. Forgot to mention that. And then we'll go up to all the candles that I have. So starting off with the smaller ones, I have this white pumpkin vanilla from Hobby Lobby. I've got pumpkin cupcake, eucalyptus ring that I got at SAS, and eucalyptus mint. And then I have this is actually Ray Dunn in partnership with DW Homes candle, and it's in warm cashmere. I really love it. It's kind of almost done, but I really love this scent. It's awesome. And then I've got blueberry pie, which I got at SAS for half off, Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit, the Our Own Candle Company Tropical Paradise. And then I have a couple fall ones. I have leaves. I got this at Candle Day last year. I have Bless, which is actually pumpkin pecan waffles, which I just got at SAS for, I think it was $8. I have cinnamon sugar donut. That was half price at SAS. White caramel cold brew, half price at SAS. And the same thing with frosted sugar cookie. Um, this is Christmas morning from DW Homes that I got last Christmas. It smells really good. It's just like basically coffee <laughs> and I love coffee scents. And then I have cinnamon caramel swirl, also $8 at SAS and spice gingerbread, which is from last year's candle day sale. So basically I've used a lot of my body care and, um, I used a lot of candles and then I just got <laughs> quite a few at SAS. So this is my collection so far. And then I also am um, decluttering a few things, which I will show you guys now. 
So these are the eight things that I am decluttering. I will have them on my Mercari account, which I will link below and they will be for sale on there. So I have this Twisted Peppermint Body Care little mini set. This spray has never been used, but I have used the body lotion and the shower gel and I just don't like the smell of Twisted Peppermint. I don't know, I keep smelling the lid on this and I just, I can't stand it. So I'm gonna sell these as a set, um, probably for really cheap because only this has not been used. And then these two were from a Spring Fab Fit Fun box and I just don't, I don't like them. They kind of have a very generic smell and I would much rather get rid of these and then buy something from Bath & Body Works that has a really good smell instead of just like forcing myself to use them. And they're really high quality and I've never used them before. So I feel like I can get a good deal on them and I'll probably bundle them on Mercari. And then I have the Love Beauty and Planet um, Rose, Moo Moo Butter and Rose Body Lotion. I can't stand floral smells. And every time I would like open up the cap right here, I've never used it. It's not even like the top, it's not pulled up. Um, every time I'd smell it, it kind of gave me a headache. So I just can't use this. This was a, a gift and I'm very grateful for that. I just, I can't use rose or floral scents. They just give me a headache. And so that's the same thing with this uh, illuminating fragrance mist. It's rose quartz and I can't use it because every time I spray it, which I have sprayed it a few times, uh, it gives me a headache. So I can't, can't use that. And then I have the Cloud but Butter in Electric Blue Sky, which I've never used this. It's actually a little old. Um, it's from 2017, but I've never used it because the smell actually gave me a headache. And so every time I would open it to try to use it, I just couldn't. So basically all of these are like things that I don't like the smell of or I can't use because they give me headaches or things that I don't want to use. So. I just figured I'd get rid of them, get them out of my collection, not force myself to use them and, you know, like, hate it. So <laughs> getting rid of those. But besides that, that is my whole collection. So I just want to say thank you so much for watching. And if you enjoyed, go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe down below. I do a ton of Bath & Body Works videos. I'm a little obsessed with that at the moment. But anyways, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!